A routine city council meeting suddenly turned testy when the mayor called for a vote to install retiring Alderman James Kappelman into the vacant position of chairman of the Education Committee. That failed by an 18 to 29 vote. Mayoral candidate Alderwoman Sophia King, who's the vice chair of the committee and wanted the position, had been pushing for CPS CEO Pedro Martinez to commit to quarterly updates for the council. Well, I am the acting chair. I reached out to the CEO. He has not returned my call. I assume it's under your orders. Um, th this is just not how government should be Alderwoman run. King, <clears throat> don't make that assumption, and that's not appropriate. Okay. Things only escalated from there. And, and quite frankly, if, if you would spend more time attacking problems instead of people, all right, we would all right. be much better off. Uh, uh, Alderman, Alderman King, so. you're out of order. Thank you, Madam President. You're out of order, and I'm not going to let you make a political speech on the floor because of your aspirations. She started it. After the exchange, King denying any political motives, blaming the mayor. She chose to attack me because I want to bring the CEO in to talk about Chicago Public Schools. That's within my right as acting chair. So now you're going to appoint a new chair so that we don't hear from CPS? Who's playing politics? The mayor saying the vote against her choice of Kappelman was a reflection of the current political environment. Jim Kappelman is a good, good man. He is a former teacher himself. He has tons of experience in education, a compassionate heart, and is somebody that I have total confidence in. So today what happened was politics at work. While Mayor Lightfoot lost the battle today to make Alderman Kappelman her education chair, the fight is not over, and she expressed confidence that it will eventually happen. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.